Good morning. Happy Vlogmas Day 7, I believe. <laughs> You will see this video like in a few days, but today is Wednesday. It's only Wednesday. It's felt like such a long week, which is crazy. Um, but I think it's like our schedule just got thrown off. Like normally I have music on Wednesdays, but we had it yesterday, which I'm also gonna have it today. But we were like practicing for our Christmas show um, yesterday. And so then it felt like a Wednesday. Um, and yeah, so I wanted to quickly show you before I left for school. I got this in my pampered teacher box this little uh banner and it looks so cute on the fireplace i don't know if you're gonna or, oh yeah you can see it. um so it was this little thing it says let it snow and i just think it looks so cute i think it like definitely finished the fireplace which is funny because i didn't think it wasn't finished but now that i see it on there i just think it looks so cute so yeah this just came in the box and it's got like a little bit of glitter on it so at night you can kind of like see the glitter. It's really pretty. So I just wanted to show you guys that. And then I also was going to show you how cute this is. Sorry if you can hear Axel eating. Um, a student got me this. It's from Starbucks. It's like one of the big cups. How stinking cute is this? It's like um, sequins all over it. Oh, I die. I opened it yesterday and I was like, oh my gosh. Totally like just matches me. So I'm going to bring that to school and use that today so i'm gonna pack up my coffee and then i'm going to head to school today should be an easy day i need to finish um christmas parent gifts and then we need to work on our um snow globe writing and what else do we need to do today I'm just going to do like math this afternoon and then we have literacy center. So it should be a pretty easy day. So I'm excited. So I'll see you guys when we get to school. Okay, I'm in my classroom and I quickly wanted to show you guys a couple things that I had um, in like the car and then in the classroom. So yesterday I went to Dollar Tree. I have this huge bag. <laughs> this is the only bag I had in my car. And hashtag I don't want to pay for bags. So I just used this even though there's like nothing in it. Um, so I had to get paper bags for parent gifts. Um, I'm going to... I saw... Or I was watching a video from um kaylee what's her name on here kaylee nicole um and she was saying she does glitter like on them so i might end up doing that just to, like jazz them up a little bit i usually just let the kids decorate them i don't know maybe um and then for my oh my gosh <laughs> for my uh raffle this week i just went and got a couple things so i got um this four in a row it's just like connect four kind of thing but it's supposed to be like a travel game so it's just small and i got a four pack of play-doh all well, it's fake play-doh um so that'd be four gifts and then i got um this little like pencil case thing which i think is kind of cute and then i got bubbles so then i'll separate these as well i could have swore i got like more than that that's so weird um but i just realized <laughs> that this beanie is in the bag from um which i was going to return but apparently i'm not going to return it because axel chewed the tag because it doesn't fit him um and i didn't realize oh wait no that's not the tag where's the tag oh maybe i took the tag off i don't know i didn't realize it was um it's extra large and he's got kind of a small head i feel like he's got like a lot of fur but his head itself is like not that big so i don't know probably not gonna return it um but the lady at dollar tree was probably like what is this <laughs> i didn't know that was in there so i have all that stuff and then i could swear i could swear i got something else for the gift or for the raffle that's so weird i don't know um and then i wanted to show you guys these are so cute so these are um a big huge bag of scarves so one of the parents in the second grade group um makes the kids scarves every year for the winter show and so then they can wear them and they can have them like afterward um and it's just like a simple piece of felt there's literally no sewing to it it's just a piece of felt and then she cuts um little like fringes onto it how like what a cute idea though like it probably doesn't cost that i mean 
that is like a lot of fleece I don't know um, she makes them for all the second grade classes it's not even like a student in my class but she makes them for all the second grade classes and she actually works here as well so I know who she is but um, so cute like it's such a thoughtful little thing and the kids look so cute on stage I remember seeing the first graders last year having them and I didn't realize that a parent had made them I was thought the teachers had done it and I was like oh my gosh that's so cute and then I realized this year that it was a parent that had done it and she's doing it this year again and yeah so I'm gonna give these to my kids um, tonight when they come for the show I think it's just gonna be so cute like it's such a thoughtful little gift I don't know when I'm a parent I'm gonna keep that little idea in my head because I think it's so adorable so that's that and then I'm gonna show you guys like parent gifts and stuff later because they will be done um, I think that's it so I'm gonna get back to work <laughs> oh I forgot before I get back to work I want to show you guys my outfit for today because I'm so excited. Okay, so I've got on my um, earrings from our store. I wear these like so often. I just feel like they like I have a piece of hair in my mouth. Um, I feel like they're just like the perfect little earring to wear. I don't know. And then I just threw on this black sweater because it was kind of cold, but I have just a black um, sweater underneath it. And then I have on some black pants. So I have an all black outfit today. But the best part is my shoes. So um, one of you guys that watches my videos, who I know has watched my videos for like a super long time, her name is Tracy, and she um, had contacted me on Instagram and had said that she had found the boots that I was looking for at her Walmart, and so she ended up sending them to my P.O. box, and I'm so excited. They're probably, like, way too extra for school, like, way too much, but, like, I just had to. I had to. So, they are the cheetah print boots from Walmart, and they just look like this. I think they're so cute um, with an all-black outfit. <clears throat> when I'm like not at school I would probably do an all black outfit and like maybe like a red lip or something or like I have those red tassel earrings that I got in my pampered teacher box that would be really really cute but I feel like for school like definitely tone it down a little bit um, but I think it'd be so cute for like a holiday party or like Christmas day or I don't know so I'm so excited so thank you again Tracy like that was seriously like, the sweetest thing anyone's ever done for me um, the fact that you just did that like out of the kindness of your heart like so sweet so um because i looked everywhere i mentioned in the video like i've looked everywhere for them and i could not find them um and i had the black ones but i just could not find the cheetah print ones and then every time i kept checking online they didn't have my size so and i don't like to order stuff like that just because i don't know how it's gonna fit and i'm like kind of finicky about shoes um even though the black ones fit fine like sometimes even different colors can fit weird so um but luckily these ones fit like perfect so yeah anyway I'm gonna go get back to work now. <laughs> All right, and I'm already back at home. So we had our Christmas show tonight, which I think I said that this morning. Um, and so I just got home from that. It is currently like seven, 6.37. Um, so I was gonna make some dinner. I was gonna show you guys what I was gonna make. So I was actually like making something. Dude, no, 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 no. We're not getting the ball. How about you go outside? Okay, so Christmas show went well. Um, anyway, I'm gonna make dinner and um, I was copying a recipe I had seen on um, Mallory, Mallory Urban. She's just a YouTuber that I watch and she had posted, oh my goodness, boob, dude, take it. Um, she had posted <clears throat> this recipe and I just thought it looked really good when I saw it in a video one day, so I wanted to copy it and I've just been waiting, but anyway, so you just take some chicken breast and then um, you put um, some egg egg um, on a plate. I'll just do paper plates. And then some shredded Parmesan cheese and then some like Italian seasoning. And then you do like the egg or you do the chicken in the egg and then you'll put it in the Parmesan and then you'll just bake it. Um, and then I'm gonna do green beans with it because green beans are like one of my favorite sides. So let's make some dinner. Okay, so I got all the chicken made. The I feel like the stuff didn't stick as well as I thought it would, but it's fine. I think the cheese I used was a lot like longer than the one that she was using, so it worked. I just dumped like the rest on there, so 
I'm gonna put this in the oven. I'm gonna put it in there at like 375. I did make the pieces a little bit smaller so it wouldn't take so long to cook. Um, and then I'll just kind of watch it and just make sure it's fine. And then I'm gonna do some green beans. And I just buy these like frozen green beans. I'll throw them in the pan, uh, on a pan with like some parchment paper or foil and then put them or put olive oil on them and then salt and pepper and I just bake them <clears throat> until they're to the consistency I guess <laughs> that I like so that's dinner I'll show you when it's all finished all right I'm all showered now and cleaned up but I was going to quickly show you the what I don't know what I was just about to say I was going to quickly show you our food and then um, I'll catch you guys tomorrow so this is how it turned out it looks pretty good I have obviously haven't tried it yet but it looks pretty good this is Skylar and then mine and then I ended up making um, these little breadsticks they're just like frozen this one's actually different than that one um, this was like the last one in the box and that was a different box but these are actually really really good you just pop them in the oven and we always eat them with pasta but I just figured it'd be kind of good with this since it's garlicky and yeah so looks pretty good and I will catch you guys tomorrow in no not a different vlog it's gonna be the same vlog so I'll catch you in like two seconds all right it's the end of the day and did I vlog anything this morning I don't think I did <laughs> I don't think you guys have seen me since yesterday but it's the end of the day on Thursday um, I am sitting here putting together my Christmas gifts for the kids. This camera angle is just like not working. So I basically, I decided to, I printed these off of TPT. Um, it was just like from like a little pack that I said, I said, I found. Um, I'm very, I am very lucky to have you in my class. And then I'm going to tape their headphones to the back of it. And then what I'm going to actually do is I'm going to take a Sharpie and write their number on the this part of the headphones and then I brought some clear nail polish that I'm gonna put over it just so that it'll last better um, they are like all different colors so that alone will help them like distinguish which one's theirs but just in case and then the number like won't stay on I don't think if I do it with just sharpie so I'm gonna do a little bit of clear nail polish and then hope that that works I don't know I'll probably tape them on first so the nail polish can dry So, anyway, um, today was a crazy day. We're so ready for break. <laughs> um, but it was pretty normal. We got I got all their parent gifts done. I got them sent home. They're out of sight, done. Um, and then I just need to finish these. And then I need to do some cooking tonight for our party tomorrow. I'm making, like, Mexican corn salad, which I make, like, for parties all the time. It's super easy. So I need to do that. And then um, that's pretty much it. I want to, like, just clean up the room. The room has been a disaster um for this like, entire week but I think I finally am like getting the messes under like situated um I do want to take those donuts off the wall and hang up their what are they called their snow globe writing um which I'll show you those when I'm uh, finished doing this um so yeah that's pretty much it pretty usually the day before break I'm like kind of freaking out about stuff that needs to be done but I don't feel like too like out of ordinary today so I'm going to get that done, and then I'm going to make tacos for dinner, which I'm excited about. And yeah, so just drinking water. <laughs> Nothing too exciting. So, I'm going to get this done. I'll catch you guys in a bit. <laughs> Okay, I was gonna quickly show you our um, little writings and how they turned out. So this is, this one doesn't have a name on it, so. Okay, so they basically did writing on the bottom. They were supposed to write about how, or like what their snow globe would be like. And then I just did the plate on top and they just drew and then I put up some salt in there. I ended up just using like school glue, like Elmer's glue to glue it shut and it seemed to work fine, so. My friend had said, or my my partner had said to use hot glue, that's what she does, but it seemed to work fine. I don't know how long it would hold up, but I don't know. It's probably fine for now. And then I'm going to take down those because those are from the beginning of the year and then put these up instead. So I'm going to change that out. Alright, I'm just about to head out, but I was going to quickly show you, I always, I literally say the same thing every time I talk, I'm so annoying, um, I wanted to show you that this is all finished, 
Um, and I realized the reason I always scatter them is because I can never get like the placement right. And if I scatter them, then I can like, I don't know, make it look better. <laughs> I still have like three kids I think that are not finished with like one piece of it. So I will be able to fill in like that and then that and that, but it's not going to be completely full. So it's fine. I, yeah, it's whatever. <laughs> and then I was also going to tell you guys, and I don't have any, like, it's actually, I wonder if this. Hmm. You, no, that's like completely crumpled. I was going to tell you guys what we did in our math win group this week, or on Wednesday, Thursday, just because I think it's like an easy idea for, um, like right before break. So I had printed a sheet and it just had like a, a addition problem and then it had three boxes. So the, the way I wanted it to be played, but we didn't play it like that today, but it's fine, um, is that they would solve the problem and then we would throw it, throw it up, oh my gosh, we would crumple it up throw it like a snowball snowball fight and then they would pick it up and then have to solve that exact same well they'd have to check the person before them and then they would um solve it using a different strategy so then like the third time they'd have to solve it using a different strategy and <coughs> bless me um and then so they had to solve it using like a completely different strategy than the first two times so the third one was like kind of difficult because if you like didn't know a bunch of other strategies and it just might be kind of hard so it was pretty <coughs> it was pretty fun um I think well I do have like the higher group of kids for math um the ones who've like already mastered this skill and so it was easy for them to I feel like do it like that I don't think I could do something like that with my whole entire class unless it was like a very easy math problem like we were working on double digit addition with and without regrouping and the rest of my class like we couldn't do that in terms of like using all these different strategies like they definitely be, definitely be able to do it with, like one strategy but not um like trying to find three different strategies if that makes sense so super easy idea though and I just like had them you can kind of see on this one it was just like cut into like half sheets of paper because once they've crumpled it up a couple times it does get like kind of weight or like just not good so I didn't do like a whole sheet of paper I just cut it into I think it was like three pieces for each one I don't know why my ears like I feel like they like need to pop or something and I feel like I like can't hear that well I don't know what it is um anyway I just realized too I was gonna show you what I got my partners for Christmas and I just wrapped it all up so I'll tell you um I saw or I put in the last vlog I had found the happy planner notebooks on Clarence still which is where I got mine and so I bought each of them one of those and then I got them in, for their happy planners the like an in the inserts that are um like the the flags for like the top so you can easily like flip to your page so I got each of them a pack of those they're super cute um and then oh and then these cute like little binder clips that I found at Joann's so super cute um and then I got all their Christmas um gifts done I put their number on it so I just put oh I just put the number and then I just put a little bit of clear nail polish over it so cross your fingers that that stays I I don't know we'll see I'm just gonna tell them they have to keep them at school because it's something that I like I wanted for the classroom that's why I gave it to them so they have to keep it at school but then at the end of the year they can you know take them whatever but i'm just hoping that that kind of solves some of our headphone problems in here and they don't really the headphones that they have now don't fit in their drawers very well and so i feel like that's another reason they're getting broke is because they're trying to close the drawer and the headphone doesn't fit very well and so then it's like breaking it because they're trying to close it so i don't know anyway um i was quickly showing my shirts how cute is this um i bought this a couple years ago i've showed it probably last year but it just has like little reindeers with um or I guess it's Rudolph, with um, glasses on. I got it at Walmart, like like I said, like two years ago. Speaking of Walmart, I have to go to Walmart to get dog food on the way home, and then I'm heading home and calling it a night. So I will see you guys. I probably will vlog a little bit tomorrow. This vlog was really boring. I'm sorry. Like, nothing exciting happened in the last two days. Sorry. It is what it is. After this, so my vlogs will be at home, and I'm gonna, I have a bunch of stuff planned, so get excited for that and there was something I was just about to say oh I probably well I don't say probably I might vlog tomorrow and then just have that as part of like the Saturday also uploaded on Sunday I don't know 
I'm gonna go. My brain doesn't wanna work anymore. So, it's five o'clock. <laughs> I will catch you guys on Vlogmas Day 8, I think. I think this is day 7. I don't know. I'm like thrown off because I'm not doing it every day. So, I'll catch you guys in the next one. <laughs>